Africa, the land of diverse cultures, majestic wildlife, and incredible natural wonders. But beneath its surface lies a hidden story, a tale of a continent slowly tearing apart. Join us as we embark on a journey through time and explore the intriguing secrets of the East African Rift. Imagine a colossal tear stretching over 2,000 miles, from the Red Sea to Mozambique. A network of valleys known as the East African Rift. This geological marvel has been evolving for millions of years, shaping the very fabric of the continent. It all begins with the dance of tectonic plates the Somalian Plate and the Nubian Plate. The Somalian Plate pulls eastward, slowly separating from the larger Nubian Plate. But what does this mean for Africa's future? Will Africa split into two continents? That's the big question on everyone's minds. The story of the East African Rift began around 35 million years ago, when it started forming between Arabia and the Horn of Africa. Over time, it extended southward, reaching Kenya about 25 million years ago. The rift consists of two sets of fractures, the eastern and western branches. The eastern branch, passing through Ethiopia and Kenya, contrasts with the western branch which lies on the border of the Congolese rainforest. These rifts indicate that Africa is slowly opening along several lines, stretching more than a quarter of an inch each year. This gradual separation has led to remarkable geological features, including the majestic Mount Kilimanjaro, rising high above the African plains. If Africa were to rip apart, there are different scenarios. One envisions a new sea forming between the Somalian plate and the rest of Africa. This would create a new landmass, including Somalia, Eritrea, Djibouti, and parts of Ethiopia, Kenya, Tanzania, and Mozambique. Another possibility is the separation of only eastern Tanzania and Mozambique. But when will this happen? Are we on the brink of a geological revolution? The rift in Ethiopia and Kenya might split to create a Somali plate within the next 1 million to 5 million years. However, we can't be certain. The forces driving the rifting might prove too slow, and the continent may remain intact. Failed rifts, like the mud continent rift in North America, remind us that geological processes can be unpredictable. But could the East African rift follow a different path? Will it evolve into a vast ocean basin, reshaping the face of Africa as we know it? The truth is, we don't have all the answers. Will the rift stall out or continue on its present course? Only time will tell. One thing is for certain, the story of Africa's rift is still being written. As we marvel at the beauty and wonder of Africa, let's remember the hidden forces that shape our world. The East African Rift, a symbol of the Earth's ever-changing nature, invites us to ponder the mysteries that lie beneath our feet.